Hi, this is Steve Blair from Solid Angle Support, and in this video I'm going to walk through the process of installing the SI2A add-on in a work group. So I've already downloaded the uh, add-on and extracted it, so I have it sitting here. Now I could just drag it into the viewport uh, if I wanted to install it in my user folder, uh, but that's not what I want to do. And just, uh, by the way, when I see user folder, I mean this location here, C users username in this case solid angle in here uh, but I want to install it in a work group uh, not in a user folder that way I can have different versions with different work groups with different versions and switch between them uh, as required so um, to do that I'm gonna to have to create a work group uh, basically I'm starting with a clean soft image that's never had Arnold installed so I'm gonna use the plugin manager file plugin manager go to the work groups tab file create um, this is actually my standard location for all my work groups, so I just have to give it a name. In this case, it's Satoa 2.6.0, and I'm actually going to give it the Softy Manage version number as well, uh, because I actually have a lot of different versions of Softy Manage, a lot of different versions of the SI2A add-on. So I often switch between different group groups, so I'm actually embedding the version names in the actual work group names. This may not be the case, you may not want to do this, maybe you just want to call it SI2A. Um, so it's transparent as to what version, but in my case I, I need to know, it's just easier if I know the versions. So once that's done, I have this new work group. It's been created. If I uh, go to my work groups, you'll see there's some default folders created, but uh, the add-on's not installed yet. So to do that, first I have to move this up to be the first in the list, because to install an add-on, you can only install it in the first work group in the list. Sort of a historical legacy, or historical quirk of Softy Manage. It's always been that way, and I don't know. I guess it's unlikely to change, given that it's still there. So just right-click the work group, click install.xsi add-on, find the actual add-on, and click OK. So that's going to install it. I mean, I do have an error message there, but once I restart, everything's going to be working as expected. Um, just usually when you do install, especially shaders, work add-ons, it's better to restart soft image, make sure everything's reloaded properly. And that's it. Uh, how to install the SI2A add-on, SATOA add-on, in a work group. So in the future, you know, if I want to change, I would just disconnect from this work group, connect to a different root group, say SATOA 2.5, 2013, and restart soft image. So that's how I work. Uh, but I'm in tech support, not in production. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps.